Hey Tibbs, Jimbo here. I am working on or continuing the garage organization, something I've never had. Um, so, I've started, um, I'm trying to get this cleared off again, but now that I have a rack where I can put stuff, um, it's I'm able to make it happen. So what I'm working on right now, I went to Walmart last night and I bought the biggest wire rack that they had. And I think this is a 72 by, this is it a 36 or a 40? Uh, so it's like a 42, okay. That is allowing me to put stuff away. I'm putting my, a lot of my heavy tools and stuff down at the bottom there. Um, that table saw kind of has a home now. And I'm trying to get this here cleared out. That's a 4BT cylinder head down there, which it's, it looks like a recasted one and there's a little bit of a, a, a imperfection or a, actually a, a hole going through one of the water outlets. And it's probably fixable, but I'm worried about there being other issues with that head. So I don't know if I'll ever use that for this 4BT. Definitely a waste of money. I paid like three or four hundred dollars for it. So um, if somebody needs a 4BT cylinder head and you think you can make that work, um, I would want 300 bucks for it, so I'm not shipping it. You gotta come get it. Um, I'm gonna take this to the recycling center. It's all full of empty milk jugs and oil jugs and stuff. I've already filled up that bin there. That's it's full of cardboard, beer bottles, and plastic bottles. And then that tiny ass garbage bin is full already. I'm probably gonna call up waste management and do an upgrade since uh, we do a lot of stuff here. I kind of need a bigger garbage can. Uh, but anyways, <clears throat> uh, that's kind of what's going on. This bullnose hood is got, let's see, little doomahickey there. It just needs a, a paint job, really. I'll either put this for sale, if it's your 80 to 86, Bronco, F-150, F-100, F-250, F-350. It's just a bullnose head, so it'll fit. <laughs> and then this rack right here, this is my new favorite rack. This is the um, uh, project and ideas reminder. So we have, um, me and Todd, are, we were thinking about doing a video on shooting this up. It's an old vacuum pump from his Bronco. It's a piece of crap. The mo I think the motor, the motor's fine, but it spun a bearing. Yeah. And these are the backup lights for the Explorer, or the back off, or the fuck off lights, whatever you want to call them. I want to get those put on. And then I have these amber LEDs that I want to put on. I'm not. I don't think I'm going to put them back on the truck because I'm doing something different later down the road for my pickup, but I would like to get these on the front bumper of the Explorer so I can have amber. I've already got my light bar on there. I've got my new fog lights, my new LED fog lights that are pretty, pretty nice. Um, so if I put this on here, I can have some amber for if it's like really snowy and I have to take the Explorer or want to take the Explorer. Now this little guy is a heat exchanger. Um, that's what we're going to use for Todd's water to air intercooling project. So I had a little bit of a brain fart while I was looking at this bench here and I was thinking since I have a lot of good a lot of good 2x4s buried in here um, just kind of somewhere yeah, pieces like this are halfway decent they're just kind of wet I got a long piece like this, and I think there's there's a bunch of more of these 2x4s in here that are halfway decent and they're all buried. They're the first ones to go in. I was thinking about taking some of those instead of throwing them out. And if I got enough pieces long enough, what I was thinking about doing is mounting, I could do it right underneath, put a rest of 2x4 here and probably come up to about, I'd say here's a good height. And then we'll run across. And then right about here, halfway through the bench, 
we'll have a two by four come down and it'll get screwed to here and it'll connect one piece. If I don't have one long enough, they'll get screwed together here. And then I'll have another piece come here and come down. And if I get another shelf like that, I can actually use this for materials to do what I want to do. And then I'm going to have a piece come down here. I'll move this over there somewhere. Actually, you know what? Instead of having a piece come down this way, I can have up here, have it come out. Down here. And then right along here. And then down here. And then I'll put a sheet of wood on, on top up here. And it'll give me more storage space for other miscellaneous items that um, don't need to be hanging around on the floor. And then on top of that, I can put, um, I'm going to put pegboard here. And then I'm going to get all those little organizers that you can um, hook into the pegboard. I think it would be cool because then I can get rid of this. Maybe all well, the funnels are going to get a new home soon. I got to figure out what I'm going to do. They need a new home. So I may put them, actually, you know what? We can do this right now. Thank you. Just fall right out. There we go. Might get a bigger bin for all this. But yeah. That's where that will live. Okay, I'll clear that up. But yeah, I think I'll build a, a shelf system. And then maybe get another one of these, maybe a couple of them, and string them up in the shelf. And then uh, get a nice big heavy duty power strip in there. And that'll give us a nice little workbench with stuff to store and more storage up here, more lights. Maybe I'll put speakers and a sound system in. I think it'd be cool. And then I'm going to find a new home for these buckets and then I'm going to get a little tool chest that will just come right in here in between the compressor and whatnot. So this is what we're looking like right now. Semi-organized. We've got a home here. Pretty happy with it. Now, in the house. Got some B BCB block going, but this microwave scared the shit out of me the other day. Uh, it's heating something up, and it made some weird freaking noises. I was trying to heat up some butter, and it was going, and like, yeah. Trying to clean the house and reorganize and I think I'm gonna just shit can this thing. It's annoying, I paid, well, I didn't pay much for it, but. Just find it annoying when stuff like that goes out. Hope T20 isn't all I have. Ooh, let's see if we can just barely get that. <laughs> Try to waste some time. Okay. Come with me, tubes.
Huh. There's the fan. It's not even dirty. I don't see any signs of shit stains either. Piece of shit.